Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about Apple Safari and more specifically, I'm going to answer a question that I've gotten a lot lately. And that is, how do you clear your history on Safari? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, this is going to be a really quick video. There's really not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to clear your history on Safari? Well, that's pretty easy. Maybe you've been looking up some really strange websites and you don't want your significant other to find out. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process process. It's all handled here in the Safari app. It's this compass looking thing right here. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I'm going to open up my Safari app now. Okay, guys, I went ahead and opened up my Safari app. Now here on your Safari on iPhone, if you'd like to clear your search history on Safari, first, what you want to do is click right down here on this little book clicking thing. It looks like an open magazine. Once you click in there, you're going to see your favorites on Safari. However, in order to clear your history on Safari, you need to click on this little clock icon looking thing right here on the right. Okay guys, once you click there, it's going to show your recent history on your Safari search. Now, if you want to clear your history on your Safari search, click on this blue clear button down here on the bottom, right? It's kind of small. Okay. This is really important. So you have a couple of different options here. First, you need to know that when you click one of these options, it's going to clear your history, your cookies and other browsing data, such as cash. So sometimes that can slow down your browsing history or browsing pages. If you're okay with that you need to choose how much of your safari history that you would like to clear you can choose all time today and yesterday today or within the last hour for me i'm going to go ahead and clear my history on safari for the last hour so i'm going to click on this red button here at the bottom okay just a quick second later that button disappears and there is no kind of confirmation and it's just automatically taken care of so make sure it's something that you want to do because once you click it it's just done so that is how you can clear your history on safari the first way there is another way and it's handled through your settings app on your iPhone. Let me jump on over to that. Okay. So I went ahead and jumped over to my settings app on my iPhone. It's this gear wheel icon looking thing. I'm going to go ahead and open it up. Okay. Once you click there, it's going to give you a drop down menu for your settings. However, if you'd like to clear your history on your Safari, you need to scroll down until you see the Safari app. Once again, it's this compass looking thing right here. Go ahead and click on that line. Once you click there, you're going to get options for your Safari on iPhone. But in order to clear the history on Safari, you want to scroll down until you get to this blue button right here called clear history and website data. Once you click there, it's going to give you the option to go ahead and clear history and data, but it's going to remove all of the history and all of the data on your Safari history. You don't get the option to do a certain time period like you do if you take care of it inside of the Safari browser. Also, I want to let you know if you are trying to clear your history on Safari to hide something illegal, it is still possible that the police or law enforcement can send a subpoena to have your history from Safari revealed. This is is only going to remove it from your phone, but more than likely Safari has it on their servers. So there you have it, guys. If you're looking for information on how to clear your history in Safari, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.